I think I can leave school now. I was kind of hoping for more with Steven. How could you two not hit it off? That outfit is pure you. You look fantastic. Well, we're not through with him yet. I'm going to go to the spa, get a facial, and think of something brilliant to get his attention. Ciao, Bella. Yeah, Steven's just been ignoring me so far. Oh. Oh, oh, I was supposed to go to music? Well, the game didn't explain to me that I was supposed to go to the music room. Mean game. Hi, Kim. This is Carly. If you want to go shopping, call me. I've got a million errands to run for my mom. <laughs> Later. No, thanks. Carly. Hey, Kimmy. There's a luau party at Derek Nelson's Friday. You should come. Steven's going. If you need a ride, call me. Later. Oh, Brian. I think that's Brian. Hopefully he's not angry about the book. Word is, Derek's party is going to be killer. Wear something tropical. And don't forget to bring some ladies. You can give one to Steven. Yeah, I'm not even going to bother with that. The, the last time, the last few times I've been told to get something, it was a failure. Oh, Grandma. Where is the hospital? Grandma, I want to go to this party instead. Uh, is this the hospital? Oh, hey, Kim. Uh, sorry, I missed you. The Barton Bra uh, kids, uh, lovely children that they are, blew out the sound system, so we've got to cancel the show. Uh, oh, well, that's convenient. <laughs> convenient for me. Okay, I'm here at the party. Aloha! Pineapple! Welcome to Fairyland. Cheer for the party, kid. Look at that, babe. Is this cool or what? Oh, check out the pool! It's like a lifeguard convention. <laughs> oh, man! Where's the lifeguard? Ooh, ooh, is Steven a lifeguard? I, uh, I didn't. Kimmy, you forgot the ladies? It's a perfect icebreaker. You better go find one. Oh, Kimmy, you look great. Just go talk to him. You don't need props. I don't need props. Yeah, yeah, props are silly. Just be you. He'll fall all over him. Hi, Steven. Hey, Kim, I'm glad you came. Watch the splash. The pool's almost empty from the last side. Need to give me a few pointers on this dive. Oh my! Better? That was a great dive. Somehow I think you've practiced that before. Whatever you say. You're I need a towel. Mmm, pizza. Hey, hey. Hello. Wow, that that was that was <laughs> that was pretty romantic. Um, I think. Great pizza. Romance music again. I'm addicted to it. Believe it or not, I didn't even like pizza until high school. Tomorrow night. If you're free. He asked me out. Kim, wake up. We need a gossip fix. Come on, what happened? 
Well, I watched him dive, and then I watched him eat pizza while Derek Derek gave him a lay while we had romantic music in the background, and then somehow he asked me out instead of Derek. I, I I'm speechless. He's so gorgeous. I'm still having trouble talking. He's the one. I knew he was the one. Seven Heaven, Cupid speaking. Yeah? Uh, right here. It's Stevie B. Here, Kim. Hey, I had a great time. But it just occurred to me. Why don't you give me a call when you're off work? 555-3107. That way you won't have to stress out if you run late. See ya. Well, what did he say? Come on, there's no secrets with us. Steven has his own cell phone? This guy is great! He said he had a great time, too. Oh, look at you, girl. You have it so bad for him. This girl is in there! He definitely calls for a new outfit. <laughs> yeah, I'm not getting a new outfit. That requires switching CDs. I'm trying to save money for my prom dress. I've got plenty of cute outfits. Well, I'm going shopping. Okay, looks like I have to go shoe stocking. This isn't too difficult, you just need to make matches. Okay, there we go. I made some money. Sixteen dollars. That should get me the best prom dress ever. I just closed out. Great. Be there in ten. You're gonna love the food here. Steven! Oh, hello, Mr. Wanky. Mrs. Wanky. This is Timberland. Mars! These are wonderful, beautiful creatures. Oh, hi, Steven. Did you know they serve fish here? Can you believe that? What did fish ever do to Chef Pierre? Oh, honey, we'll get the girl. Steve, can we have a word with you? I'll be right back. Oh, hi, Kimberly. Uh, hi. I take it the fish was bad? Fish are never bad. People are. It's horrible what they do. Broiling them, frying them, fully abasing them. It's criminal. Was odd. Sorry about that. The Wankies are my dad's best clients. And well, when Walt didn't want to see jump, dad says how high. When does we? Uh, can that girl talk? Never ask her about this yet. You look even prettier than last night. Your eyes are dancing in the firelight. Steven, when, 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 when did you suddenly become totally in love with me, and not Derek? Are you always so complimentary? If you mean do I date a lot, I don't. You know, I'm so tired of people being more interested in my family's money than me. So, do you like your job? Hey, hey, it was a wild party. It was I sold so many shoes, I think it's hurt from ringing up the cash register. Mr. Tanaka, how nice to see you. The Wankies were just in. Such lovely people. Jerome, this night's very special. Very private. Is that very private? Oh my. If you like pasta, the Gorgonzola Medici is fantastic. Of course, Wendy's favorite is lobster. That gorgonzola, that gorgonzola tastes great. 
And Wenda, I don't know who she is. I still have no idea who she is, but she loves fish. Poor Wenda. She really takes a spree the fish thing to heart. Right. Poor Wenda. I think I'm going to have the fettuccine. What are you going to have? 